Well, I grew up in a Christian home, and I can't remember a time when I wasn't in a very real sense part of the worshipping, believing community of the church. My parents weren't people who talked about religion all that much, but it was obviously important to them. We went to church regularly, and I sort of absorbed it through the pores. Now, of course, as I grew older, there were times of, of, of deeper understanding and I hope deeper commitment in my, my Christian life. So in that sense, I've, 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 I've had a sort of uh, uh, once born sort of life. I mean, uh, there have been moments of deeper commitment that have been significant, but I wouldn't see them as, as being uh, strictly conversion experiences. I've never felt I faced a crisis about science versus religion. I've never felt um, that I had to choose between one or the other. It's always been both and rather than either, either or for me. I'm not a person who is untroubled in their faith. I mean, I, 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 I'm not a person who is free from, from doubt. Sometimes it seems to me, I'm a cheerful person, but I'm not an optimistic person. And sometimes it seems to me that Christianity is just too good to be true. And I wonder whether that's so. When I feel like that, I say to myself, after a while, I say to myself, OK, then, deny it. And I know that I can't do that. I know that Christ's side is the side I, I have to be on. So I have a strong negative faith, but a somewhat fluctuating positive faith in that sort of way. And I think that's true of quite a lot of people, actually, but it's certainly true of me.